Hello friends, so welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in this video, I will show you how you can install Jam server on Windows 11 operating system. So let's get started. So first of all, you have to download Jam server or Jam for Windows. So simply open your browser, any favorite web browser and simply type download Jam. Okay, here you can see the first link that appears download gems so click on it once you click on it it will go to the downloads page of apacheframes.org website so you can see here uh, there are many versions for different different operating system like windows gem for windows gem for linux gem for mac here we want to install gem for windows so here we can download the version here here you can see the version 8.0.28 8.1. something 8.2.4 which is the latest version of gem so i will install the latest version of gem so simply download 8.2.4 so here you can click on download button download 64 bit so once i click on this it will start downloading of the jam server okay so this is this is basically around 140 mb file so you have to wait here you can see it is around 149 mb file the download has started so you have to wait till the download complete it depends on your internet connection how fast your internet is okay so i also wait for the downloading of this file so here you can see the download has completed successfully so you have to simply go to your downloads uh, so i will click on so in folders uh, here you can see uh, this is the downloaded file uh, which is jamp for windows 64 and this is the exe file or you can say it is an installer for windows so you have to simply run it by double clicking on it so simply double click on it so when we double click on it it will ask me to allow this so simply click on yes once i click on yes it will start installation of the gem so i will close this so here you can see it is showing me some warning so simply click on ok browser so here you can see the setup for jamp jamp installation so simply click on next basically it is very simple you have to click on next 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 like you install any other uh, software on your uh, so here these are the components that you want to install you can check or uncheck simply check the component that you want to install if you simply click on next it will install all the components but i am not going to install all the component i will install mysql and php my admin only okay so simply uncheck that i don't want to install so i uncheck all these so here you can see i have selected only uh, apache is default mysql and php my admin okay so here you can select all those component that you want to install or you can install all of them so, okay so it's up to you so i'm going to install apache mysql and php my admin so apache is default mysql and php my admin i want to install so i have selected these two so simply click on next so here this is the path where jamp will install so you can select the part you can change this part so by default it is c directory uh, jamp okay so it will install jamp in my c directory under gem folder so simply click on next here it is asking me to language uh, so simply click on next and here you can see ready to install now your gem is ready to install on your computer so simply click on next so here you can see the welcome to gem installation and the the actual installation of gem has started okay so it will take a few minutes so you have to wait till the process complete okay so do not close the window here okay simply minimize this or wait for the installation so here you can see the setup has finished installation jam on your system and uh, it is asking me do you want to start jam control panel now and if i check this and i if i click uh, finish it will start jam jam control panel okay so i will click on finish so once i click on finish it will start jam control panel here you can see uh, it has started jam control panel you can start apache and mysql services here okay uh, i will close this 
and I can open this from searching window simply search for jamp control panel okay so if you search jamp control panel here you can see this is jamp control panel so you can also start by click on this uh, once you click on this it will start jamp control panel okay so if I click on Apache uh, uh, if I click on start button uh, uh, next to Apache and MySQL so it will start Apache and MySQL services so I click on start here you can see Apache services is running properly and if I click on start MySQL so here you can see MySQL services is also running successfully so here Apache and MySQL services is running successfully that means you have successfully installed Jamf server on your Windows 11 operating system here you can also open localhost PHP my admin so here you can see it's working perfectly and it has opened PHP my admin that means you have successfully installed Jamf server on your Windows operating system so congratulations you have successfully installed Jamf server on your Windows operating system I hope you have also installed Jamf on your Windows operating system if you are facing some issues here if you are facing some error so kindly comment below the video uh, I will read all the comments and I will try to fix the error if you are facing any error okay if you like the video if you are successfully installed Jamf server on your system please like the video share the video and subscribe to our YouTube channel so thank you for watching this video.